And a warm welcome from the south coast of England. We find ourselves at the Vitality Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary. And alongside me is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Bournemouth against Leicester City. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Well, for the visitors, Stuart, we're talking about the worst defence in the league. Room for improvement, certainly. Well, I just can't see how they keep a clean sheet today. At times this season, they've been shambolic at the back. The distance between the defenders has been far too big, and therefore, they're too easy to play against. And the starting 11 for Bournemouth. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. And the lineup for Leicester City. Yuri Tiedemanns plays alongside Wilfred and Didi in the engine room. And beginning the game up front is Jamie Vardy. And the match begins. And the attack looks promising. And let's give credit to the defending. Vardy. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. Dominic Solanke. It looks promising. Leicester doing well to win back possession. Kieran Dewsbury Hall. And the keeper getting across to stop it. to take it short here Dewsbury Hall well, just the tackle that was needed Dominic Solanke Solanke well they keep working away looking for passing lanes Smith Really vital interception. And he's knocked it out of play, so a throw-in is the decision. Couldn't keep it. James Madison. Tielemans. See some progress with the ball at his feet. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, here it is again. And it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. But you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. Oh, 
are back underway and 1-0 it is let's see what happens next Lewis Cook losing possession a bit easily a room to roam on the wing but they took care of the situation defensively Philip Billing might be able to get in behind the defence an effective challenge and the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack Harvey Barnes untidy in possession well getting close to the half-time interval and the story so far they're not really making home advantage count Stewart you take well, I've been a little disappointed with their attacking play. It's all been a bit too slow. If they can pass into their front areas with more quality, switch play quicker, and be more positive in 1v1 situations, I think they'll get back into this. And he takes it on. And he's done it! Parity again! A magnificent game unfolding. Well, here's the replay. He's got such quick feet, hasn't he? Just look how he goes past his marker to get his shot away. That's a really good goal. Back underway. One goal apiece here. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Vardy. Went in strongly to win the ball. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Well, there it is, the half-time whistle. We've reached the midway point of the game here at the Vitality. And so the match is... So back underway here into the second half. Party. A very effective challenge put in. The Foxes moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? And offside. Well, close one. Bournemouth struggling to keep possession. Vardy Terrific block Solanke Now indeedy 
Well, there you have it. Leicester have controlled most of the possession, but they haven't done enough with it, particularly in the midfield areas, where their passing has been far too safe. And that needs to change quickly if they're to win this one. Nice looking pass. That's well blocked. Well, no threat posed by the cross. Disappointing pass. Cook. The supporters want to see him have a go. It has to be. Well, that's how to hit them. Not quite accurate enough, though. And they will make the change now. Kieran Dewsbury Hall. And it wasn't a great pass, was it? Soranke. They could nudge in front. Well, no examination at all for the goalkeeper. And on that basis, he's going to be a bit cross with himself. James Madison. Jamie Vardy now. This is a message for Kieran Dewsbury Hall. Can you please make it Harvey Barnes. Thank you. Well, they've given him too much space. And thwarted there following the cross. Lewis Cook. Chance to do damage. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Tielemans. All even, but will it stay that way? Harvey Barnes. Precise ball movement. Chance to play it in. DD. Now with Vardy. Must take the lead here. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Substitution for Leicester City, coming off the pitch. Number 22, Coming onto the pitch, number 11, Matt Well, time is running out to get this winner, but the fans certainly believe it's coming. Just listen to the noise. What a fantastic finish we could have here. Well, the defending needed to be a bit more switched on than that. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. Well, this forthcoming corner might just do it. Could be their last chance to hit the front in the dying moments. <laughs> Playing it in. Not away completely. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Tielemans. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Oh, can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. Amazing scenes here. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike.
And the referee blows for full time. Not what Bournemouth fans had in mind this, a defeat. And Stewart, I wonder how you would assess their performance. Well, Derek, it was a hard-fought contest, which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out.